Hey everybody, what's up? This is Prof Toast here. So, today Kingdom Hearts 3D Dream Drop Distances came out, so I figured to go ahead and do a little unboxing of the special Mark of Mastery edition for you guys. So as you can see, pretty nice boxing. Pretty thick actually, so I definitely like that. It's about, I think about 55 and everything, so it's not too bad. For a special edition, as you can see, it shows all the cool stuff you get in it, which we'll get to in just a second. Alright, so first we're going to remove the sleeve. As you can see, definitely classic uh, Kingdom Hearts pattern in the back with Mickey and friggin' the crown and everything. So it's pretty cool. On the back shows the Kingdom Hearts 10-year uh, anniversary and everything. So it's definitely, that's, that's pretty awesome. Friggin' 10 years it's been around. Alright, so let's get to actually opening it up. As you can see, right out of the box, of course, we got the game right here. And right here, let's see. You get these, um custom Kingdom Hearts cards which are definitely pretty cool. So you just go from like, you know, very first game to the second. So it just basically kinda goes through like all the games and everything. Which is definitely really cool. Oh wow, they have these ones in there too. I remember seeing some of the keychains from this. You can see yeah, they get you pretty decent little art cards and everything. And of course Burf I Sleep just barely finished that. Might do a review on it pretty soon. Uh, recoded, I remember that one. Another Burf I Sleep, freaking awesome game. And yeah, I did one for the newer one right here. So yeah, pretty nice little set of stuff they give you right there. Go ahead and put that right back in the package. Then on top of that, they also give you a 3DS shell. As you can see, 10th year anniversary shell. Kingdom Hearts logo and everything. Go ahead and show you how it looks on the DS in just a second. And let's see. Oh, as you can see here, I guess inside the box they actually give you some pretty nice looking art in the back. So yeah, not bad. And of course you get the game. We all know. So it's basically nothing much here except you know their little Square Enix code thing, Club Nintendo, your average little booklet that tells you, hey, how do you do the controls? But of course if you look in the back right here, you get little pictures and everything of all the little dream eaters, I believe. Actually, let's see here. So yeah, it's actually kind of cool. I love it. This is, uh, I remember Kid Icarus Uprising did the same thing where they had a little secondary thing in the back. So let's go ahead and set that to the side for the time being. Alright, next that we got in the box are the um, exclusive set of AR cards that unlock uh, rare dream eaters that you get in the game. Let's go ahead and just open this up real quick. Sorry, bear with me. There we go. Blah. As you can see, there's like one, two, three, four. So yeah, you get about five cards in this. Whoa. So yeah, definitely pretty nice. I like that. So I'll have to test those out later and actually figure out where in the game that you get to activate them. Of course, so you take off this piece right here. If it'll let me. There we go. So you can see I definitely love the inside of the box right here. Definitely really nice artwork, so cool but pretty cool to see that in a actual one of the special edition boxes like that. Because usually it's just kind of like the outside and that's all you get. So I mean yeah, if you want to set that up in your room, that'll that look pretty sick. So, okay, so let's go ahead and grab my 3DS right here and test out the shell. If it'll come on then, there we go. I don't know, I usually never really bother with shells, so we'll see how this one feels on my 3DS or not. See, and then a little on the fact that... If it, oh, hold on, i put this against the table so y'all can see. So it looks pretty nice and everything, but of course my 3DS is black with black detail, so this may or may not look good. So you can see it snaps on pretty easy. Get your little back panel right here, if I, put, if I put it on the right way. So yeah, so as you can see, like unless you see it in the light, you can't see the design too much. But other than that, I don't know, so yeah, see right here, I already don't like it just because, like I don't know, makes these not feel as outdented, but other than that, I think it's a pretty cool case. I might actually just keep it in the box just to keep it nice and fresh looking so it doesn't get any scratches on it. 
So yeah, but that was the unboxing of the Kingdom Hearts Mark of, Mark of Mastery Edition. Sorry, I just totally messed up on that name. But yeah, so um, I'm not sure if this is available unless you pre-ordered it. So I mean, if you were able to go to any store and actually they have an extra copy, then I would say go ahead and pick one up. Definitely worth it if you're a Kingdom Hearts fan. So yeah, I, I felt it was worth it. I liked it. It was definitely looks going to look awesome in my room. So hope you guys like this unboxing and there will be more to come. Thank you guys for watching and catch you guys later.